What's good, YouTube? In today's video, what I have for you guys is an absolute banger gameplay. We dropped 30 kills in today's video, man. We go absolutely crazy with the TAC-56. However, the TAC-56 did get a nerf. I know it says in the patch notes that the headshot got increased, but it actually got decreased. They messed up in the patch notes, but hey, man, are we surprised it's Call of Duty? But I got you guys with an insane 30 kill gameplay that I actually got over on my live stream last night over on Kick. Make sure you guys go drop me a follow, guys. I live stream every single day over on Kick. We're streaming every single night, getting these gameplays live stream just for you guys. And hey, man, if you guys do enjoy the content even more, make sure you guys go down below and drop a like on today's video. Make sure you guys subscribe and turn on post notifications so you guys never miss another daily video from me. And make sure you guys comment down below. With that being said, guys, the class up will be at the end of the gameplay. So without further ado, enjoy. Let's get another one here. One more time, you know the end was great. Ooh, really good start. MP5. Oh my god, I'm probably gonna die doing this bro. Why am I pushing this? I'm kind of stupid Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god Johnny One more time. What in the fuck? Wow, this kid's literally just underneath. I mean, we got the 20. We could still do something. You got gas in. I just don't know how much more we can do. I hate that there's only fucking one UAV per bar. What the fuck is that game? Uh oh. I just don't have AR ammo. Oh, fuck you. 
I don't think there's more in here though. No? I do not like this. Wait, a buy station moved down here? Oh my god, it did. Uh, no self res, I guess. We do have zone. Need like a precision. Dude, they're literally just all cornered up in there. Dude, it's just me and this kid in the heli, bro. There's no absolute fucking way. And what did you think was gonna happen, chat? What 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 did this kid actually think was going to happen? Come on, chat! Turn, turn, turn me up! Back to back, man! Hit that follow button, man! Come on! Oh my god. Alright, man, for the first attachment, you guys do want to put on the Harbinger D20 for the muzzle. It's going to give a sound suppression, bullet velocity, damage range, and recoil smoothness. The only tuning I did, guys, was bullet velocity. Now, for the barrel, you guys do want to put on the 17.5 inch Tundra Pro barrel for damage range, hipfire accuracy, and bullet velocity. The tuning we did, guys, was damage range and recoil steadiness. For the optic, guys, I'm telling you guys, this is probably the best optic to use for all the ARs. This is the AIMO PV4, but you guys can use whatever you guys prefer. But I'm telling you guys, the AIMO PV4 is probably the best option the tuning we have guys is aim down sight speed and far then for the magazine you guys do want to put on the 60 round mag just so you guys have more ammo capacity you guys can wipe out squads without even reloading and last but not least guys for the ammunition you guys want to put on the 5.56 high velocity for increased bolt velocity and the tuning we did for the ammunition guys was damage range and bolt velocity so hey man so as you guys put all these attachments together you guys got the best tac 56 class setup here after the nerf in season three of warzone hope you guys enjoyed today's video with that being said i'll catch you on the next one i'm out peace